Um, that's, a, that's a company that we work with down in Melbourne. I'd like you guys to take a minute now and ask yourselves a question. Hand on heart, hand on heart, what's the one thing holding your business back from reaching its full potential? Take a minute to yourself and just think about it. And you might even want to share it with other people around you as well. What's the one thing holding you back from reaching your full potential? Doing this, then I'll work you through 
a decision making process of how you can actually choose which is the right option for you. And people really love having that independent sounding board and I get called all the time about it. The nicest thing is, is that if we do come up with recommendations for you, um, and it might be for the digital marketing strategy, whatever it is, there's like hundreds of things we can recommend, you get an access to the business growth grant, $20,000 worth of match funding. It's dollar for dollar funding. So the first round, we've got grants from $20,000 up to a competitive grants up to a million. Okay, this one here is based on eligibility criteria. So if, for example, you need someone to help you um, with government tenders and writing up your tender documentation, and say they're going to charge you $8,000, the government's happy to put in $4,000 if you're happy to put in $4,000 too. So it has to be a commercial investment, and it's something that the business has said, yep, that consultant actually did provide that service, I'm happy to pay it. Every business advisor is different, and this is, and every engagement we have is also very unique. So one of the frameworks that I use, and one of the, it, it's not for all companies, but one of the frameworks that I use is based on MIT, Stanford's work, birthing of giants. If you guys are in MIT companies and you're looking at scaling up, this is like a 101 textbook. It's by Vern Harnish, and it's called Scaling Up. It's the book used by Rack Space and Fusion Soft. Um, Scott Farquhar Jones has written a testimonial that this is the kind of text you need to be following, discipline and focus if you want to scale up your business. So one of the things I do with an engagement is we come up with, I don't know if you guys have seen, one page strategic plan, but we come and we start drafting up one page strategic plan together and we set priority goals based on this. Um, but everybody's um, engagement is very, very different and every business advisor works very differently too. But the program's there and I welcome you to come along and join us. Who's eligible? It's a non-competitive grant. So the thing is sometimes with grants you say, oh look, I spent five months during the application and I got knocked back. I want you to know this one is if you tick the boxes, and you know, Amber's here from the, the head office as well, we try really, really hard to get everybody engaged in these programs. So part of the eligibility criteria is that um, you need to have turnover of 1.5 million to 100 million, or expenses of 1.5 million over a 12 month period. Um, you need to have been running for at least three years, because as you know, if you past the three years you're out of that startup phase and the brain works differently, there's different challenges you come into once you're more established. You have to be solvent, registered for GST, um, you must have an ACN, and um, so an Australian company number, and you must also be for profit. Unfortunately, we can't help not for profits. As much as we'd like to, it's one of the policy criteria that we have to work with for profits. The other part of the eligibility criteria where it gets grey, and this is where I welcome you to contact me. Don't think you can fill in the form and whatever. Call me and I will do my best to try and work out and navigate with you and for the program. We have five growth sectors that you have to work for. Um, food and agri, med techs, um, mining, oil and gas, advanced manufacturing. This is where you guys kick in from the IT side, enabling technologies and services. If you, have, if you are an IT company, a digital marketing company, a, a professional service, and you have customers in one of the five growth sectors, or you want to have customers in one of the five growth sectors, We'll, we'll get you into the program. We can kick in for you. Okay. So the eligibility is on. Even for us, it takes us a bit of a learning curve. But I invite you to contact us to help you through that. So how do you apply? Um, you can complete the online application form or phone a friend. Hint. <laughs> um, then head office checks your eligibility and see your rural ACN and everything else is eligible. Then you get allocated an advisor like me. Advisors stay with the business for 12 months. So once we're in there, we're almost like a paid business coach. We're a free service for an eligible business. So we stay with you for 12 months. We'll come through all, we'll go through what we think your priorities are and what your objectives can be. And um, that's it, You're, you get access to the grants. Um, like I said, the first round of 
funding is for 20000 If you're a hyper-growth, and I work with a lot of high-growth companies, you go for a second round of $20,000 worth of funding. We also have access to a program called Innovation Connections, which I can't cover in the next 10 minutes, but there's, um, there's money there involved too for a lot of IT companies and development stuff. That's my contact details. I welcome you to reach out to us. I've also asked George to New South Wales to be here too. And is here too from our hot head office. So we're very well we welcome you to um, come and ask us any questions. And if you're not sure, please remember we're here to serve you. So please reach out. Thank you. Such a great caliber of presenters tonight. I didn't realize there was so much available.